Hi, in uh, today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to select multiple layers on Photo P website. So, all you need to do, just go and open the browser that you're going to use to follow this tutorial tip. So, let's go. so, of course, here in my case, I'm actually using Brave. But, of course, in your case, you can use any other browser. Could be possibly working for you. So, of course, let me, uh, when you open your browser, just go to the URL section and type photop.com and hit the enter button. So that will certainly will take you into this page, which is going to be your home or your main screen. And from here, you can actually create a new project, open something from your computer, choose uh, some of their PSD templates, or you can just drop your file right here and start working on it. For me, I'm just going to click at create a new project or new projects. I'm going to choose like a simple design or simple templates from here. And of course, you'll need to wait until it loads correctly. So once it's loaded, you will find your full templates here. And every component in this template, you'll find them here at the right. And of course, you can like start editing on it or I don't know, you do whatever you want with it. And of course, if you like uh, make a bad step or you want to go back, all you need to do or yeah, you moved something or like you delete something and you want to go back. All you need to do, just go and hit the control Z button. Of course, if you hit that multiple times, you will just go back to the original template. So, of course, how to select multiple layers, uh, which is the idea of this tutorial on photo P websites. So, as you can see now, when I go here to the left, first of all, as you can see, we have like components of this of this template. If we click at any of them, it will be selected. And of course, let me just let me just like create an even a new layer here. Drop it here, maybe a second one. So we have like here five flyers. So how to select them all? Simply, we'll need just to click at the first one, then uh, then hold the control key on your keyboard and start clicking at the others. And now, as you can see, everything is selected. If you want to delete them all, you can just hit the delete button. Oh, okay, so we will need at least to have one layer. So let me just remove that. Click at delete. And as you can see, we select them all. We delete them all. If you want to go back, click Control Z. And we're going to be good to go. So that will be actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching it. Goodbye.